It's time to face it. Our healthcare system is killing us. America's failure to tackle the healthcare crisis is literally shortening our lives, your life. Medical expenses rank as the leading cause of bankruptcy in the US. Last year alone, 137 million Americans grappled with the burden of paying medical bills accumulating a staggering $88 billion in debt collectively. Yes, $88 billion in just one year. And despite outspending every other developed country, our health outcomes don't reflect the investment. Contrary to the belief that higher spending equates to better care, a comparison reveals that 100 Americans would lose 31% more years of life to illness and disability than their counterparts in an average developed country, exploiting loopholes and influencing politicians through lobbying prove more lucrative than enhancing efficiency or quality. Our government is no longer serving the people, it has been bought and sold. Big Pharma reaps billions, with a single drug like OxyContin generating $31 billion. These profits fund lobbyists, who in turn, shape laws to secure even greater gains. In 2017, around 300 former Congress members and staff became healthcare industry lobbyists, leveraging their political connections for laws impacting your well-being. The broken state of our healthcare transcends political affiliations. It's a symptom of a corrupt system. This corruption is why the Affordable Care Act falls short of its promises, why preventative care funding was slashed by over a third, and why America's opioid crisis spiraled out of control. In the face of this seemingly hopeless situation, there's a ray of hope for healing.